Yo, yo, so, um, so I'm scrolling the uh, social medias, and, um, this is something that I thought about, so I'm gonna want to do a quick breakdown of this. The, um, the, the Pop the Balloon dating shows is, I doubt it's gonna work. And here's why, here's the problem with these Pop the Balloon dating shows, and I spoke on this before. You give somebody a balloon, temptation, they gotta pop it. Especially the women. You, 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 first of all, you got the women standing up in heels. Women don't like to be standing up in heels for a long time. They, their ankles hurt. Their legs get tired. You can see them just standing. They always like they doing little leg trembles and stuff. They irritate it. Of course, they're going to pop a balloon because you give them something to hold. You ever give a woman something to hold? They don't want to hold on to it too long. You give, them, give, give, give a woman two bottles of water. Hey, babe, here, hold two bottles of water. Eventually, they're going to be like... Can you hold this for me? If they could pop the water bottle like they would a balloon, they'd just pop it and get it over with. So women don't really love to hold stuff. Um, they they purse and that's it. And these women be up there with their heels on, standing, uh, holding their purse, and then you give them a balloon to hold and a needle. So it's also and it's like a um. The and then like when you have a balloon and a needle, that's like a potential for uh a pop. So, of course, they're going to pop it because it's just there. You just got two things. It's kind of like if you give somebody vinegar and baking soda in two cups. They're going to mix it. For the, They're going to mix it. It just, you know, if you give somebody a cup of water and a cup of ice, they're going to mix it. It's just like, why not? So that's that. The Another thing, too, is um, so I think the first step to fixing that is to have them in a seat. Let the lady sit down, be comfortable and um, have, like, the needle on the table and have, like, the balloon, like, on the table, too. So they could just sit there. And then if they want to, they have to pick up the objects and then pop them. Um, another thing, too, is a lot of these women are just popping balloons because somebody else pops a balloon. Like, you'll see it. Or men do this, too. Like, somebody will come out. They'll say something. Somebody will pop a balloon. Then all you hear is pop, 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 pop. Like, everybody's just kind of following suit. And you know they're following suit because when they ask them, so why did you pop your balloon? Um, I don't know. Uh, I just feel like, and they give like the most, like, non-answered answers. Like, no, nah, well, I mean, I like guys that are taller than me. And you are taller than me, but um, I just don't know. I don't know. And you like, okay, like, whatever, whatever. It is what it is. Um. So there's that, you know, it's 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 just the follow the leader mentality. And the reason why they do this is because women don't want to feel like w- they're in competition with each other. So as soon as the first woman pops a balloon, she's saying, oh, no, that man's not good enough for me. Y'all can have my leftovers. And women are, who are in competition, they don't want to feel like they're settling for somebody else's no. So they're all going to pop the balloon anyway just so they can feel it oh well if you don't like them then i'm a pop it too and you can see the lineup like if there's like a if there's like a there's pretty girls there's medium girls in there too if a medium looking girl pops their balloon the pretty girl's gonna look at her like oh she's saying no okay well pop i'm pretty than her so if her standards is saying no then my standards should be higher so i'm gonna pop my balloon too there's a lot of that going on too also, another thing, because also, yeah, women, they don't want to feel like they're getting there. They don't want to feel like they're um, the last resort. And so if women say, if you get like, let's say you got 10 women, if eight of them say, oh, no, no, I don't want him. Then it's like, it's the same reason why some men say they wear like a wedding ring and they, or they wear like a fake wedding ring to get more women because women only want uh men that other women want so by these women dismissing them if no if enough women don't want the man then nobody's gonna want the man that's why when it that's why if if three if two people pop their balloon off rip you're gonna hear four five six seven balloon pop then pretty soon everybody will pop the balloon there's one episode i uh there's one clip i watched because i haven't watched the full episode but i watched one episode and these ladies popped the balloon before the dude even got out like three they didn't the dude didn't even answer three questions yet and all the balloons was popped 
And it's like, God. And then when he was talking to the one on one, they actually seemed like, oh yeah, yeah, you know, okay. They they had a good conversation. There was some chemistry there, but they all popped their balloon way before, like, you know. And then and they get, you know. So I don't know, but anyway. So that's that. The the third thing is also um, because of the way the show set up, women know that there are more men in the back. So it's kind of like they don't want to feel like they're settled. They're like, okay, if this man comes out now, I want to know what's behind the curtain first before I, um, before I, cause they, they, they're thinking like, okay, if I pop the balloon now, or if I don't pop the balloon and I end up going off with this dude, then I might miss out on what else is over there. I don't know what's over there. So they want they want to know what's over there behind the curtain. Um which I I can understand that, you know, because I'll guarantee you on that show the first two three dudes, they going to get they don't the balloon will get popped on because if they know it's 10 dudes behind the curtain, the first three you nobody's nobody's going to just jump at the first three cuz they think it okay, there might be something else back there too. And, um, so yeah, I do think to fix that, they could just have a lineup of all the guys first and then have all the women at least look at all the guys and then they can kind of look at them all and they can pick, okay, I really like that one. I don't like that one. I like that. So that even when that guy does come out, if he does come out number two, then they know, okay, out of all the guys that I've seen, I really like this one. Maybe I won't pop my balloon so quickly. I think that will be a way to fix the um the balloon popping show. But um yeah, other than that, uh and then the men too. Now some of the men they be popping the baby. A lot of them be a little sassy. To the men, a lot of the men I can see they pretty much just show up and they just stand and they have like their red pill rage speech ready. And then that's so that's one thing, but but yeah, so that's about it. Uh, we'll end it right here.